this is Coach Hester from Crowder's Creek. This game is called Sock Basketball. I have Gage with me this morning who's going to show you how to play Sock Basketball. To play this game, you will need a laundry basket and a pair of socks. Now you can play this game in your house. If you play it in your house, please make sure that other objects, lamps and things of that nature are out of the way. I set the basket up about 10 feet away and Gage is going to shoot as many times as he can in one minute to see how many he can make. Now you can play this game in the house, you can play it in your garage, you can play it outside. But the game starts in one minute, Gage will shoot and after he shoots he will run and get the socks and he'll come back to the line and shoot again. He'll shoot as many times as he can to see how many times he can make the basket in one minute. Now you can play by yourself and you can record and say, okay, I did that many this time, the next time, see if you can beat that record. You can play with friends and compete against them. All right, Gage, ready, go. One, he's hustling back. He's still hustling back. He's got one right now. Two, that was a good shot. Three, now he's doing an underhand toss, and that's probably the best way to do this. Four, and he's doing a great job. Up a little too far, but he's hustling, and he's getting some aerobic work in. Five, nice work. And this is the game you can play. Another game to go along with the sock basketball is so the sock three-point contest. And just like in the All-Star, NBA All-Star game, I have three pairs of socks around the basket, and they would have 30 seconds to shoot the different socks. And again, you can keep a record of how many socks are made in that time period, you can compete against yourself, and you can also compete against your friends. Be careful when you're playing inside. Be safe, have fun. Thank you.